Hi, hello, and welcome to another fun and exciting episode of The Crafting Coach. Thank you so much for joining me. My name is Megan Rosendahl. I am The Crafting Coach, and this week I'm going to show you something that literally blew my mind. Okay, not literally, but you know what I mean. Decorative jars can cost some serious moolah, but this week's project will save your dollars and expand your possibilities. I'm going to show you how to make these personalized labels that you can use on practically any surface. And you won't believe how easy they are to make. So here's what you'll need. Printouts of the words you'll want to use, printed off a regular old printer, and clear packing tape. You'll also need something to put your label on. I got all of these at the dollar store. A bowl of regular tap water, and a tongue depressor. Seriously, prepare to be amazed. Honestly, I was super skeptical about this project before I started, but now I am convinced. Sorry, honey, I'm probably gonna put labels on everything in sight now. Begin by deciding what words you wanna use and print them out. Then take a piece of packing tape and cover the words. Take your tongue depressor and go over the words so they're firmly pressed against the tape, and then just cut out your design to the size that you want it. Grab your bowl of water and simply drop your piece into the water. You'll notice that the paper will curl up as it gets soaked. Leave it in the water for one minute. When you're ready, pull the paper out of the water, flip it so the paper side is facing up, and simply rub your thumbs along the paper, removing it as you go. And you'll notice that the words we printed stick right to the tape now. Be sure to get all the paper off, let it dry for maybe 15 or 30 seconds, and then just apply it directly to your surface. Rub out all air bubbles and set it aside to dry. And once the tape dries again, it becomes sticky again. How cool is this? You can use these on glass, plastic, tin, honestly anything that packing tape will stick to. Create labels for all your kitchen jars or personalize a gift for someone special. This would be such an inexpensive way to create a custom wedding or birthday gift. And you have access to as many fonts that you have in Microsoft Word or whatever other program you're using. I would love to see what other ideas you come up with. Please send any photos to mrosendahl at aberdeennews.com and those photos could show up on a future episode of The Crafting Coach. That's all that I have for you this week, but I will be back next Friday morning at 11 a.m. with another brand new project just for you. We'll tear it apart, we'll break it down, I'll tell you what to do, tell you what not to do, and hopefully we'll have just a little bit of fun along the way. Be sure to follow my Crafting Coach board on Pinterest. You can find me under Megan Rosendahl, and also be sure to follow the American News online and on Facebook, where every single Crafting Coach video is available for you. On the American News homepage, just hover your mouse over the Features tab and scroll down to The Crafting Coach and then just select whatever video you want to watch. You can also follow The Crafting Coach on Facebook, and you can now tweet me at crafting underscore coach. Can't wait to see you next week. Bye!